The Hawaii Clipper was one of three Pan American Airways Martin M-130 flying boats. It disappeared with six passengers and nine crew en route from Guam to Manila on July 28, 1938. Instead of this aircraft landing in its supposed destination, it mysteriously disappeared, despite this case being one of the most eerie disappearances in aviation history. There are theories that may explain how this mystery occurred in the first place. The Y Clipper deported Guam on the last leg of the westbound journey at 11.39 local time on July 28, 1938. The last radio contact was 3 hours and 27 minutes later when the aircraft reported flying through layers of clouds and moderately rough air 565 miles away from the Philippine coast. Subsequently, the U.S. Army transport ship named the USAT Migas found an oil slick along the course of the lost aircraft about 500 miles from Manila, took samples, and stood by to investigate. The oil samples collected by the ship had no connection with the aircraft. Search for the point was called off on August 5, 1938. The theory that is most widely believed suggests that the plane has crashed due to structural and mechanical failure. This is a theory that might seem quite obvious, but since this crash took place in 1938, there are still many open gaps to this case that questions this theory. Another theory that is much more specific and perhaps more enticing claims that Japanese agents hijacked the plane and flew it to Tinian. Considering that there was no debris found and the time of the disappearance, this theory may actually have a chance of being valid. The main reason why this case remains unsolved is because of the many loopholes and questions that have yet to be answered. This causes the theories as to what may have happened lose some of its validity. Despite all of the theories and speculations surrounding the case of the Hawaii Culper, it still remains unsolved.